Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Emily. Thank you for stopping by. If you've been here before, then welcome back. And if you haven't, then welcome to my channel. I am obsessed with Primark, so today is definitely a Primark day. I went to a Primark that isn't in my local town, and um, which if you've watched any of my videos before, I always say they're the better ones. Don't know why it is. Maybe it's because you get used to what's in your own one. I do go every Saturday, so maybe that's why. When I go to like a different town, I just think they've got a larger selection because they've got more floors. Mine only has two, one being women's, one being men and home. So today I actually went to the Blackpool one, which has four floors, maybe. So yeah, I went a bit cray cray. This is what I've got, two big bags. I'm not gonna move them because I've rested them against each other because I've just had about 10 minutes fighting trying to stand them up. So let's just get on with it and see what I've got today. I've got some amazing things. I think so let me know in the comment section any of the items that you like and which one's your favorite because I just like seeing and also if you've got anything in the sale or in Primark recently drop it down there so I can see and hopefully I can go and find it for myself because I can't stop spending money so let's just get on with it also um, I recently wore this same lipstick in a previous haul I think don't know which haul it was but it was one of my hauls and I got a lot of messages on my Instagram about which one it is so I thought I'd quickly show you it is one of the Maybelline Superstay ones, but I got this in Tesco, reduced down to £3.50. They are normally £9.99, so I either get them, obviously if they're reduced then that's amazing, but otherwise I get them in like Superdrug on the three for two offer, because um, they are £10 a lipstick otherwise. But they're amazing, they stay on all day, like they are cray cray. Cray cray is the word of this video. Um, so yeah, if you put it on in the morning, that's it, you're done all day and you'll struggle to get it off at night. So definitely invest in a few of those. I pretty much have half the collection now. Okay, so first item is this little cutie. So I got this blazer jacket. It is like navy and white and it's got white buttons. This was a size 10. I think most of the things I've got were in the sale. I'm sorry. I just, I go in and I see red signs and I just run towards that, towards, towards that section. So size 10 it was 17 pounds reduced down to 10 pretty sure when i got to the till this was five though so five pounds and i just think this is super cute i love um how you can turn up the sleeves i've just done one there but if not you can just have them normal and it's just a, i don't really have navy very often but this to me will be beautiful in summer with a white top and denim shorts it'll be also cute over a white like simple like smock dress i just think i'll get a lot of wear out of it i absolutely love blazer jackets i like putting hoodies underneath them uh, cycling shorts and a crop top and white trainers like we're getting back into the warmer months. We're not, it's absolutely freezing, but we will be soon. So I just think this is a nice investment ready for that kind of weather, but it can also be the white turtleneck, black jeans in winter too. And I'm just a sucker for a blazer. I really, really am. I don't know what it is about blazers, but they pull me in. And especially when it says 10 pounds, then you get to the till and it's five, five pounds. Sorry, I feel like I'm speaking very fast as well today, but I think I'm just a bit excited. I've just had a coffee. Um. So yeah, size 10, 10 pounds down to five. Buzzing. Should I try it on here? You'll probably be able to... No, I'll wait. I'm being impatient. I just really want to try it on. How gorgeous is this? I'm absolutely obsessed. This is so beautiful. It's very similar to a cord pink one that I've got from Primark. So it hasn't got shoulder pads, but it's very, very structured. And then it's got the white buttons. I just think the colours are beautiful. Probably will roll the sleeves up because they are a bit long. This is a size 10, so definitely true to size and a good fit. And um, because I would rather have it too big than too small. Um, it definitely fastens up and it looks super cute. So I'll wear it either way. You could even wear this with some white jeans and nothing underneath and button it up. That would be well cute. Definitely wearing that. Um, yeah, I just think it's cute. It's got real pockets, which are always a plus because I hate those fake pocket situations. And I just think it's a really cute pattern. You can wear different colours with it. Be nice with the whole fuchsias underneath and some white jeans. Can't wait for white jeans to come out. Not come out, but be allowed out in acceptable weather. So yeah, this will definitely be staying in my wardrobe absolutely living for the whole neon vibe at the moment um and i was while i was on my way to blackpool i was looking on the pretty little thing website for some of the sports socks that they've got at uh, five pound a pair they are so i was like right wicked when i get home i'll order those and then when i got into primark <laughs> they had this set these were two pairs for two pounds and you get the bright yellow and a pink 
So I was like, forget that, two pairs, two pounds. The ankle socks, and I just think these are super cool to wear them with your trainers. So I was just looking down to see if I had any trainers with me, but I don't. So yeah, these are just super cute and they just make a simple outfit like fashionable because neon's fashionable right now. So I'm totally jumping on that bandwagon. Don't know about the yellow ones. They might be a bit outrageous for me, but these pink are cute. I'm living for the pink ones. I'll definitely wear the yellow ones at some point. Like I won't let them be wasted, but two pairs for two pounds. And I can't wait for the weather to start warming up again so I can get my cycling shorts out. These will be perfect um, in my trainers with my cycling shorts and oversized hoodies. So these are a little investment for future brighter weather, but I'm hoping this neon thing stays in because I'm feeling it. The next item my mum was actually fuming at. Um, so I found this little beauty. There's fluff flying about, so you can guess it's fluffy. Um, for seven pounds. Now there wasn't one in her size, so she was fuming. So sorry about that, mum. But a, a black aviator jacket. Look at this. Seven pounds. Seven pounds. It's got like the fluff and the fluff and more fluff, and it's black and it's just seven pounds. How much was it originally? Let's have a look. So I got it in a size 10. It was supposed to be 30 pounds and I got it for seven. Mind blown. If I was a good YouTuber, I'd do that. But I'm not, I can just about upload one. So welcome to the basic life. But I just think it's amazing. It's got all the protectors still on. So like no one's even taken this home and brought it back. Like this is brand new. And today I wore an outfit. I don't know if you can see. I've got like a green skirt on probably just saw my spotty bra there sorry about that but you can't when i'm not in front of a ring light oh excuse me honey. this is what i mean by i was fighting carrier bags for 10 minutes um so yeah i wore a green and a black outfit today and i just needed a black coat and the only black coat i have is a leather jacket and it was actually raining outside so i just had to go with it in a black jacket but i needed a thicker warmer black jacket and then i saw this absolute babe for seven pounds I'm amazed. I do have an aviator jacket, but it is grey and pink, so I struggle to wear it with many things. So it's probably going to end up on my Depop. I'm having a clear out this afternoon, so I'll link my Depop down below because I can't put all these things in my drawers. I'm, I'm physically hurting myself trying to close my drawers, and I'm not even being dramatic. So I'm about to have a huge clear out this afternoon. So yeah, go and look on my Depop if you like my kind of style. Um, this won't be on it, but my pink and grey one might be, and it's beautiful. So yeah, got a new babe anyway, replacement one, haven't I? Seven pounds, seven pounds for a coat. Like Primark, how do you do this? Winner. Now this is what dreams are made of, this one. This is an absolute yes. This is beautiful, seven pounds. These are on Pretty Little Thing, I think it's like 45 and more. Like this is absolutely beautiful. Such a good quality coat. I just think the whole, I've still got these on. Let's just pull those on probably can't get it off with one hand oh we can what a challenge this is just beautiful i'll get plenty of wear out of that and i just think it's super cozy the quality feels amazing it's a good size it's definitely true to size because the shoulders are in a good place i could probably fit a jumper underneath which is a plus as well or i could wear it with like just a crop top and it'd be quite oversized so yeah definitely happy with this very happy for seven pounds the only bad thing quick on Look what it does when you wear black underneath. That's not great, is it? Oh well. One bag down. Next, oh. Next item, oh. I keep getting a weird feeling through my face. Okay, next item is another sports sock. Like, I'm literally obsessed with this. Oh, it's not a weird feeling. I'm getting attacked by fluff. Anyway, next item. I'm definitely obsessed with this whole sports sport. <laughs> Maybe YouTube isn't for you, Emily. You can never get your words out. I'm definitely obsessed with the whole sports sock um, thing that's in at the moment. So these are ankle socks. These are one pair for one pound. And there was a black, can you see these? A black and gray pair. Just really simple to wear, as I say, in your trainers, with joggers. Because I've got some black joggers from Misguided and like the length. The length is long, because I am not super tall, but the length is before my ankle, so I like to put a sock on with it, and this just gives a little bit extra with a bit of grey, wear, uh, wear a black jogger and a grey hoodie, or add white into it. I just think it's cute, and like I say, I looked on Pretty Little Thing, £5 for a pair of socks, £1 for a pair of socks. Yeah. And then, obviously, I had to get them in another colour. 
So I got the red and white ones. Don't know why I'm doing this when they're right back here. This is what I mean. Maybe YouTube isn't for you. <laughs> oh God. So yeah, absolutely obsessed with this whole striped sock thing. And why pay like Adidas and Nike prices when you can get a pound and have sport strop strops, sport stripes on your socks for a pound from Primark. And they add a bit of red in as well, which is pop of colour. So you could add a red lippy, white joggers, them, banging. And then this just took uh, sports socks to a whole other level for me. These babies. Love these. These are my favourite ones. These were in the sale. These were £1.50. But again, £1.50 for a sports sock. Absolutely amazing. And I just think they're super cute. They'll even be cute coming out at the end of a jean. And then like a nice white top in summer and a white trainer. Especially a nice mom uh, wash jean. Just obsessed. Like... I hate the whole secret sock thing. Like, why Why can my socks not be seen? I'm wearing socks and I want to wear socks. Why do I have to be secret about it? So get beauties like this and then your socks look pretty. Why are socks not pretty anyway? I don't know. Like, I'm wearing socks. Sorry. But now I'm wearing cute socks. I wish I could wink. Oh, I can. Is this beautiful skirt. So I got this in a size 10 as well, I hope. I didn't check, actually. Yes, I did. I got this in a size 10 and this was... £13 reduced down to five in the sale and it is this beautiful animal print pattern with the black buttons down the side and then it's got like an open slit. I just really like this with an outfit like today so I've just got like a stretchy Primark basic tee on. I think this was like four or five pounds a while ago. A um, Baker Boy hat, this black boots and a leather jacket or my new aviator jacket. I'm tapping there and it's not even there aviator jacket oh it's there then in summer as well this with a black cami top and sandals um a brawler like this can be changed up and it's the cute animal print that's in at the minute so i'm all over this but i just think for seven five pounds that this is an absolute bargain and a fashionable bargain bang on trend and it's affordable so i won't feel bad when you see this on my depop in a couple of weeks maybe even next week when i've worn it a couple of times i will wear this a couple of times so you won't be seeing this on depop sorry to disappoint get down to your primark if you want one for five pounds oh i'm not sure on this so it's a bit longer than i thought it would be it's cute it's just a tad longer and a bit more i don't know i don't know let me know what you think i do think it's really cute it's very flattering i'm loving the whole slit and the buttons just not sure about the length and this whole shape feel Mm, don't know really don't know it's cute though definitely cute Sh mm, don't know. let me know can't decide last item and this is one of those where i want to say it is fugly so fugly it's one of those that you would see fugly what a horrible i don't know where that came from um this is one of those that reminds me of a lady that would be not stereotyping or anything but sat on the bus with her trainers on and her dog and you'd be like oh she probably smells like, that's a horrible thing to say but this is what i'm stereotyping this jacket as but i also love it also actually it reminds me of your dad attending the car boot that's it that's where i'm going with this this is someone's dad not mine because my dad won't wear camo i hope but this is somebody's dad attending the car boot with the cargo trousers on and their work boots and looking dapper in their own little style. Not dapper. I, w I won't look dapper in this, but I'm absolutely obsessed with it. It's like the teddy bear material. It's camo. It's got the ring um, a zip, which I just think adds a little bit of trend to it. It goes in at the bottom, but not too much. And I just think I will absolutely wear the hell out of this with joggers and crop tops underneath. It's that ugly. It's amazing. I don't know something dreaming in i do like a bit of camo i'm a bit you know i get drawn in with that but i just think it's casual but it's cute and i just i'm, I'm all for it but i do think it looks like you'd add at the car boot but maybe my dad will like it my dad never likes anything i wear but yeah anyway i got this in a size extra small purely because they didn't have anything else but it looks a decent size anyway because a size extra small is technically a size six to eight and this was don't know how much it was originally because the tag's been ripped off oh 20 pounds it was 20 pound reduced down to five five pounds so whether it's fugly whether i'll wear it twice five pounds 
and I won't, I'll wear this a lot because this is a bit of me, but I think it's ace, five pounds for this and it feels super warm, it's really, really thick and I just think it's lush, like it doesn't look like it's from Primark to me, this is very um, pretty little thing kind of style, cargo trousers, big chunky boots, looking like a dad at a car boot and I'm feeling it. This is exactly as I thought it would be, so it is super cute but super kind of ugly but I'm absolutely obsessed, I just think it's like fluffy, it's warm, it's it's teddy bear, it's camo, it's got everything going on and everything that I like is going on. Obviously I wouldn't be wearing it with an animal print skirt, but you did you if that's for you, but I would probably just wear this with black joggers, black top, things like that, like quite a basic outfit underneath, but you know, mix it up if you want to, not saying this isn't a thing, but it's just not my thing. But yeah, um, I like the fact that it's got a little collar, it zips up and it's like stretchy around the bottom. As again, it's tr very true to size, so get your size, even though this is extra small. So maybe downsize if you want it to fit like this, because they are, I wouldn't be zipping it up anyway, I don't think, but they are, there's enough, there's enough coat. So yeah, downsize depending on how you want it to fit, because as I say, this is an extra small. So this is technically one size down for me, but yeah, super cute and I love it. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. As I say at the beginning, please do comment down below if you like any of the items or if you've recently bought something for an absolute bargain. Let's all share that down in the comments section because I love hearing about what people have bought. Like, hence why I started the YouTube channel. I absolutely love seeing what people have bought and then going and buying it myself. So, um, yeah, if you did like this video, please give it a thumbs up so I know. And also hit the subscribe button if you haven't already so that you know, um, you don't know. If you hit the subscribe button, then the notification bell then you will know when I upload, which is usually on a Wednesday and Friday. No, it's not. It's usually on a Wednesday and a Saturday, but I have been throwing in there the odd Monday. So it may be going to three videos a week. We'll keep it at two for now, but the last couple of weeks has been a Monday, Wednesday and a Saturday. But Wednesdays and Saturdays, you will definitely see a video from me. So thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next one.